All right, thanks everybody. I'm Nora with Travel Leaders and today I'm gonna to introduce Frank Westfall from Walt Disney World Resorts and he's gonna tell us so many wonderful things about what's new with Walt Disney World and everything you're gonna to wanna to see and do when you book your next vacation there. So Frank, I'm gonna let you take it away. All right, well, welcome everybody. I just wanna do one quick, make sure that's, Okay, so hopefully you're all seeing the screen okay. I, it should be anyway. Looks so great. welcome, perfect. Welcome everybody, it is great to be back. Today we're gonna to be talking all about the Walt Disney World Resort. And so should you have any questions today, please don't hesitate to ask them in the chat box or the Q&A box and we'll do our best to answer them for you. But today is kind of a high level overview of the Walt Disney World Resort, what's at the Walt Disney World Resort, and things that you can enjoy during your Walt Disney World vacation. So with that, let's dive right in. First up, of course, this is a fantastic year for the Walt Disney World Resort. In October of 2021, the Walt Disney World Resort celebrated a milestone of 50 magical years. And that celebration continues all throughout 2022. So it's a wonderful time to be visiting the Walt Disney World Resort now through the rest of the year as we continue to celebrate this milestone anniversary for the resort. Now the Walt Disney World Resort comprises several different areas. In fact, fun trivia for you, the Walt Disney World Resort is roughly the size of San Francisco or twice the size of the Isle of Manhattan, just roughly 47 square miles of enjoyment. And there you're going to find incredible theme parks, resorts, shopping and dining districts, golf courses, and so much more. But let's start off, of course, where that magic all began with the first theme park at the Walt Disney World Resort, the Magic Kingdom. This is where the magic began on October 1st, 1971, welcoming guests down Main Street, USA with spectacular views of Cinderella's Castle. Here, you'll get to step into memories of the past and make new memories with your family as you enjoy lands of wonder and enchantment, exploring Adventureland, Frontierland, Tomorrowland, Fantasyland, and beyond. This is really where a lot of the Disney animated films come to life and where most people, when they think of the Walt Disney World Resort, they think of the Magic Kingdom. The iconic Cinderella's castle is the highlight of the park and of course, one of a fan favorites for photos. Magic Kingdom has incredible attractions for you to be able to enjoy, wonderful performances, and of course, all of the beloved Disney characters. In the Magic Kingdom, to celebrate part of the 50th anniversary, we have a brand new nighttime spectacular called Disney Enchantment. This extravaganza will take place at the Magic Kingdom, and it's an immersive experience which, bit, which will feature Disney music, enhanced lightning, lighting, and of course, fireworks that extend from Cinderella's Castle down Main Street, USA. The show is going to inspire everyone to believe in magic. This also has um, an emotional original song entitled, You Are the Magic by seven-time Grammy winner, Philip Lawrence. And throughout the show, stunning fireworks fill the sky, providing great experiences for guests throughout the park and the neighboring resort hotels. In Disney Enchantment, we join dreamers like Tiana, Miguel, Rapunzel, and brothers Ian and Barley from Onward. And we set out on an incredible journey with adventures such as Moana, Rhea, and Judy Hopps. Joe Gardner from Disney and Pixar's Soul takes us into the zone where we discover a whimsical world inspired by the style of legendary Disney artist, Mary Blair, and filled with beloved characters from classic stories like Beauty and the Beast and Alice in Wonderland. To contemporary tales, including Luca and Wreck-It Ralph. Everything builds to a climatic moment as Tinkerbell takes flight, spreading shimmering gold pixie dust and empowering us all to believe in ourselves and the magic all around us. 
Disney Enchantment features characters, moments, and music from dozens of Disney and Pixar animated films. The show takes us beyond the ordinary to a land of magic where we're swept up in a world of wonder filled with friendship, love, and fun. Through it all, we'll discover we only have to look within to find the power to believe and make dreams come true because the magic was inside us all along. Disney Enchantment takes place on select evenings throughout the year at the Magic Kingdom. Make sure to talk to your travel professional when planning your Walt Disney World vacation to make sure you're visiting the Magic Kingdom on an evening to enjoy Disney Enchantment. Now, over at Epcot, this incredible theme park is two theme parks in one. In the front of the park, we have the incredible Tomorrowland experience. Here you'll be a test dummy and set out on a test track or board a hang glider and soar over the world. And exciting new attractions coming this summer such as Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind and more. In the back half of Epcot, you'll discover World Showcase with several different lands and countries from around the world that celebrate each its unique world and diversity. You'll find not only interesting artifacts and cultural references to each destination, but of course some of the Disney that is inspired from those countries, including in Norway, Frozen Ever After, and the ability to meet Anna and Elsa. And over in France, the reimagined France Pavilion, Pavilion has a brand new restaurant featuring the creperie, featuring incredible crepes, as well as a brand new signature attraction, Remy's Ratatouille Adventure. For the 50th anniversary at Epcot, Harmonious illuminates our shared humanity, bringing to life the vision of Epcot through a celebration of our world and its promise. Over the years, cultures from around the world have provided inspiration for Disney films and music. In Harmonious, a global community of musical artists have come together and reinterpreted those familiar stories and songs in their own voice, honoring their respective cultures. Collectively, they contribute to a unique experience that could only happen at Epcot, a place where the impossible becomes possible through the power of human imagination and the magic of Disney. The show moves through three distinct chapters inviting us to gather on the shores of World Showcase Lagoon, celebrate the countries and cultures of the world, and ultimately unite to create a bright tomorrow. Harmonious begins with a sunrise, and as the world awakens around us, we set out on a journey that takes us across the globe. It's a dazzling and diverse feast for the eyes and ears from the South Pacific home of Moana and a Middle East interpretation of Aladdin, to the Jungle Book in India, China's legend of Milan, the European nations that inspired Brave and the Hunchback of Notre Dame, and so much more. Harmonious takes place nightly at Epcot and is a show that when you're visiting the Walt Disney World Resort, you will not want to miss. As I had mentioned earlier, Remy's Ratatouille Adventure launched just just in time to kick off the 50th anniversary and has quickly become a fan and family favorite not to be missed. Remy's Ratatouille Adventure is available for the family to enjoy by utilizing the Lightning Lane with an individual attraction selection purchase or by staying in our standby line to enjoy Remy's Ratatouille Adventure. Whichever option you choose, you are going to enjoy Remy's Ratatouille Adventure at Epcot. Next up is Disney's Hollywood Studios. Here you step into the movies that make Disney magic with incredible lands and experiences. Hollywood Studios in features incredible new lands recently, including the largest expansion to Disney's Hollywood Studios, Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Here you can live your own Star Wars adventure in a galaxy far, far away and explore the largest new land we've ever added. It's an exciting landmark for the Walt Disney World Resort and Disney's Hollywood Studios. 
Star Wars Galaxy's Edge is the single largest themed land expansion, and you'll be able to live your Star Wars story from flying the Millennium Falcon and exploring remote outposts where adventures await. Here, you'll travel into a thriving port of rogue traders, droids, and strayed creatures while exploring the planet Batu. Black Spire Outpost is the largest settlement on the planet of Batu and is an infamous stop for traders, adventurers, and smugglers traveling around the outer rim and wild space. The two anchor attractions are Millennium Falcon Smuggler's Run, where your clients can take control of one of three unique critical controls. And Star Wars Rise of the Resistance, where you can join an epic battle between the First Order and the Resistance, including a face-off with Kylo Ren himself. And last over at Disney's Hollywood Studios, the newest attraction to have opened is and one of my personal favorites, is Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. The show's Mickey-centric projection onto the Chinese theater gets us ready for Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Believe it or not, it's the first ride-through attraction ever based on Mickey Mouse. It'll play off a complete transformation of Disney Hollywood Studios by putting everyone inside a living Mickey and Minnie cartoon for an immersive, fun-filled adventure that the whole family can enjoy together. Inspired by the new Mickey Mouse shorts, the attraction will let you burst into Mickey and Minnie's cartoon shorts world with surprising twists and turns. Featuring a new original story and lovable theme song, it will be a fun-filled joyride with Mickey, Minnie, Goofy, and friends. Guests will be able to engage with their favorite characters like never before, thanks to new technology that will turn flat world of colorful cartoon shorts into a dimensional display of amazingness. And as the two-dimensional cartoon world transforms into an astounding multi-dimensional experience, you won't even need 3D glasses. What's so good for families is children love the new Mickey Mouse cartoon shorts, and this attraction is one the whole family can enjoy together. Mickey is loved by all, so whether you're 8 or 80, this experience will be fun for all ages. Next up, Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park. Here you'll explore all of the different realms of the animal kingdom from different continents and destinations like Africa and Asia to worlds not yet discovered like Pandora. This is an incredible theme park where you can go on an African safari or you can ride an incredible attraction high up in the Himalayas. And of course, travel into outer space and visit a unique world with floating forests. Speaking of that, let's take a look of Pandora, the world of Avatar. This incredible land, whether you've seen the wonderful film or not, or looking forward to the new films coming out later this year, here you will be immersed into the incredible floating forests and at night, the wonderful bioluminescence. Two incredible attractions to be found in Pandora. Here, the Navi River Journey. This relaxing experience is a boat ride through the bioluminescent forest as a Navi shaman serenades you. Or for one of the most popular adventures at the Walt Disney World Resort, board a banshee for Flight of Passage. Here, you can feel the banshee right beneath you as it breathes in and out and you soar high above the planet, flying in and out of caves, over water, and landing in trees. It is an unbelievable emotional experience that families will not want to miss. And as part of the 50th anniversary celebration, Disney Kite Tales takes the magic of nature and Disney storytelling to new heights, immersing everyone in a gala performance of color and movement at Disney's Animal Kingdom Park. Now, if our four theme parks weren't enough for you, 
We also have our incredible shopping, dining, and entertainment district called Disney Springs. Here you can come savor the day and enter Disney Springs in an eclectic mix of unique boutiques, one-of-a-kind eateries, and jaw-dropping entertainment. There are four neighborhoods to explore at Disney Springs. The Landing, a tasty waterside district absolutely overflowing with spectacular flavors. Town Center, where unique boutiques, one-of-a-kind flagship stores, and a playful promenade lets you relax, refresh, and reconnect. Marketplace, which offers everything from crystal glass coaches to sportswear with a Disney flair in one of the hippest Disney shopping experiences around. And West Side, which ignites the senses with the sounds of applause for world-renowned shows and the tempting aroma of treats to be discovered. Brand new, at Disney Springs is a collaboration between Cirque du Soleil, Disney Imagineering, and Disney Animation Studios as we prevent, present Cirque du Soleil and Disney drawn to life. Talk to your travel professional about obtaining tickets. If you're a Cirque du Soleil, Cirque du Soleil fan like me, you're going to love this very unique collaboration between Disney and Cirque du Soleil with a wonderful storytelling and incredible Cirque du Soleil talent. Or if you've never seen a Cirque du Soleil performance, this is an incredible time to be immersed into the wonderful costumes, incredible music, wonderful art and stage production of Drawn to Life. Talk to your travel agent today for tickets. Now at the Walt Disney World Resort, we love to celebrate special events and holidays. And it seems like no matter what time of the year you visit the Walt Disney World Resort, we have something special and magical going on. At the beginning of the year over at Epcot, we kick off the Epcot International Festival of the Arts. This is presented with colorful, delicious musical celebration for the arts Guests can introduce their inner concierge to an exciting extravaganza filled with extraordinary artists, gourmet fare, stage productions, and amazing acts. Epcot International Festival of the Arts is included with your admission ticket to Epcot. Also at Epcot, going on right now, is the Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival. Each spring, we celebrate flower and garden with unique topiaries, wonderful floral displays, unique merchandise, and wonderful music concerts for the entire family to enjoy. Again, Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival is included with your admission ticket to Epcot. Takes place each and every spring and is going on right now. Then in the fall, Epcot kicks off the longest running international food and wine festival in the world, taking place with additional countries to explore incredible culinary delights, wonderful wine and beer preferences, I guess, of course, for our guests ages 21 years and older, and a wonderful concert series. The Epcot International Food and Wine Festival, of course, is also included with your admission ticket to Epcot. Epcot International Food and Wine Festival does have select seminars and experiences available for an additional fee. Now moving on to the fall holidays at the Magic Kingdom, one of the most beloved and fun experiences is Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party. Mickey's not so Scary Halloween Party is a special ticketed event that takes place on select evenings in September and October. Your travel professional is, of course, the first to know when these tickets go on sale. So if you'll be heading down in September and October and looking to experience Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party, make sure to let your travel professional know so that you can get your tickets booked as once they go on sale, typically in early summer, Tickets go quick. For Mickey as Minnie's Not So Scary Halloween Party, the Magic Kingdom comes to life with incredible Halloween decorations, 
Halloween costumes. Guests of all ages are welcome to get dressed up in their Halloween finest to enjoy some incredible trick-or-treating, a wonderful parade, and of course, spectacular fireworks. Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party, select evenings in September and October. And to finish out the year on select evenings at the end of November and December is Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. This special ticketed event does take place on select evenings in the Magic Kingdom Park and has an incredible parade, wonderful fireworks, wonderful hot chocolate and cookies for everybody to enjoy, Christmas carols, and so much more. Whether you're heading down in winter, spring, summer, or fall, there is something for everybody with a special festival either at Epcot or at the Magic Kingdom for you and your family to enjoy. Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party tickets typically go on sale in early summer, so make sure if you're traveling during that time frame and you'd like tickets, let your travel professional know. Now beyond our incredible shopping and dining district of Disney Springs, our four wonderful theme parks, we do have two world-class water parks for you to be able to take some downtime and enjoy. Disney's Typhoon Lagoon Water Park is like a surfside playground left behind after a great storm washed the ship boat Miss Tilly atop Mount Mayday. A star attraction of this park is Crushing Gusher, one of the only water coaster thrill rides in the world. Created from the washed out remains of a dilapidated fruit packing plant, Raft riders are propelled on an extreme gravity-defying adventure up and down twisting caverns that lead to the tranquil waters in Hideaway Bay. In a Typhoon Lagoon exclusive, guests can come face to face with all the colorful creatures of the Caribbean when they snorkel in Shark Reef. A saltwater pool where snorkelers swim fin to fin with exotic marine life, including butterfly fish, French anglefish, tangle groupers, and even nurse sharks. The park also features a water playground for children, sunny beaches, lazy streams, and eight twisting and turning water slides. And of course, when visiting Disney's Typhoonga Water Park, you can't miss the two and a half acre Wave Lagoon. This lagoon boasts one of the world's largest artificially created waves for body surfing and surf lessons are available on select days prior to park opening. Or head over to Disney's Blizzard Beach Water Park, created when a ski resort didn't exactly find a suitable climate in Florida. Unique to Blizzard Beach, guests can take a chairlift to the summit of Mount Gushmore, where they can experience several awesome attractions. A must do for any thrill seeker is Summit Plummet, one of the world's fastest free fall water slide. It sends the daring on a high speed adventure down a 350 foot slide at speeds up to 55 miles an hour. For those not quite so ready to take the plunge down Summit Plummet, Slusher Gusher is a tamer 90 foot long water slide. A great fit for any family, Teamboat Springs is the world's longest family whitewater raft ride as it takes six passenger rafts down a twisting 1,200 foot series of rushing waterfalls. The park also features a water playground for children and preteens, relaxing beaches and lazy creeks, and other exciting water slides. Then when visiting the Walt Disney World Resort, make sure your travel professional has set up tickets for you so that you're able to visit these incredible world-class water parks. Spend a couple hours on a hot, sunny afternoon or spend an entire day relaxing at either Blizzard Beach or Typhoon Lagoon. Now, when you're at the Walt Disney World Resort, of course, you're going to need to eat. And we've got dining options galore for you to choose from. If you're on the go, just trying to get in as much attractions and entertainment as possible and are quickly moving, we have quick service dining locations for you to be able to enjoy all throughout our resort hotels, Disney Springs, theme parks, and water parks. 
With our quick service dining, you can now visit My Disney Experience and the Disney Genie portal to place your mobile dining order in advance. When you arrive then at the restaurant, you simply click I'm here to have your food made fresh, pick up, have a seat and enjoy. Your travel professional and I recommend that you make your dining selections early in the day as popular dining times during lunch and dinner at our quick service dining can fill up early. Table service dining. All throughout the resort, if you'd like a little downtime with some incredible menus, wonderful atmosphere, and awesome experiences, the Walt Disney World Resort features unique table service dining for the entire family. Dining reservations can be made 60 days prior to arrival and are strongly encouraged for our most popular dining locations. Your travel professional can help you make some recommendations on some incredible restaurants for you and the family to enjoy. From Ohana family style dining at Disney's Polynesian Resort to Jico, the cooking place at Disney's Animal Kingdom Lodge and beyond. Now, if you're celebrating a unique experience or you're looking for more of a culinary experience, we do have select signature dining locations. Pictured here is the beautiful Victorian Alberts AAA Diamond Restaurant for a wonderful experience for the entire family or that romantic occasion. Here you will see people propose, celebrate honeymoons, and so much more. Victorian Alberts is one of our only restaurants at the Walt Disney World that does have a dress code, but is a wonderful dining experience. However, there are a few other signature dining locations for you to check out as well, from California Grill on top of Disney's um, Contemporary Resort, with spectacular views of the Walt Disney World Resort and at night, the fireworks displays at both Epcot and the Magic Kingdom, to Citrico's at Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa, or two of our dinner shows that will be returning at a later date. There is so many incredible signature dining experiences for that unique family experience. Talk to your travel agent. And right now we do have turned at select locations, some character dining. This one does book up quickly, so make sure you make your reservations right at 60 days prior to arrival for one of our character dining locations. Here, sit back, relax, enjoy your incredible meal as the Disney characters come directly to your table for photo opportunities and more. Check out your character dining locations. Now, your travel professional will always be sharing with you the no to go guide. This gives you all of the details on everything that is open and operating for you at the Walt Disney World Resort during your stay, including venues for character dining and more. Make sure to review the no before you go guide before you start planning your Walt Disney World vacation with your travel professional. And finally today, I did want to mention a whole new world of vacation planning while you're at the Walt Disney World Resort. Welcome to Disney Genie. Disney Genie service is a complimentary tool to help you optimize your day. Here, you answer a few quick questions to let Disney Genie know what you're interested in while visiting the theme parks. Disney Genie will then continue to work in that background to optimize your day, to help you navigate the theme parks and maximize your time. You'll find your personalized tip board with recommendations on what attraction or entertainment or even dining to visit next. You'll have a tip board that gives you forecasted wait times. So if you prefer to navigate the park yourself, you can get an idea of what attraction wait times are currently and what we forecast them to be later in the day. Here, you'll also find mobile order available for our quick service dining. You'll be able to check in for your um, table service reservations or put your name on the wait list if you didn't have a reservation already. And when we do have virtual queues, which at this time there are none, that you'll find here in Disney Genie. 
This free service is available on mobile devices that have downloaded the My Disney Experience mobile app and is available for you to manage your theme park experience inside the theme park that day. It's free to use and you can use it as much or as little as you like to have your magical day. Now there is an additional service that is new to the Walt Disney World Resort called Disney Genie Plus. Disney Genie Plus is available for an additional fee of $15 per ticket per day. And this comes then with three additional features to your Disney Genie, including audio tales. This will give you some audio commentary on things that you are seeing throughout the theme parks. One of my favorites, Disney PhotoPass augmented reality lenses. If you'd like to take family selfies or pictures with Mickey Mouse on your shoulder or classic views of what Cinderella's castle looked like when it was being constructed to other wonderful lenses, Disney PhotoPass augmented reality lenses is right on your mobile device for you to be able to take some incredible photos to share immediately for that perfect Instagram moment. And then of course, Lightning Lane. Disney Genie Plus service gives you the option to more than 40 attractions throughout the Walt Disney World Resort to bypass the standby line, choosing one Lightning Lane attraction at a time for one attraction per day. Now, what does that mean? That means at the beginning of your day, when you enter the Magic Kingdom, for example, and you've got Disney Genie Plus service, you can go on to your tip board. You can see all the attractions that have lightning lane entrances and choose what attraction you would like your first lightning lane pass to be. And it'll show what time it's available for. So for example, you're there at 9 a.m. and it may show there's a lightning lane attraction available at 10.30 a.m. for Disney's Haunted Mansion. Perfect, you simply select your lightning lane for your family and friends, and then go enjoy the theme park until that 10.30 to 11.30 window arrives. You head over to Disney's Haunted Mansion. You'll scan your mobile phone or your theme park ticket and bypass the standby line. Once you've activated your lightning lane for that attraction, and while you're waiting the few minutes to board your attraction, you can then select your next lightning lane attraction for any other available lightning lane. Now you cannot repeat the same attraction on the same day. So once you've used in this example, Haunted Mansion, if you'd like to visit Haunted Mansion again later the day, you would simply use the standby line. Now Lightning Lane, although convenient and a great way for you to be able to get more attractions into your day at the Walt Disney World Resort, is not designed for you to be able to get every single attraction. So you are limited to one attraction at a time. You can't get your second lightning lane until either of one happens first. Either you've ridden your lightning lane attraction or two hours have passed and then you can get your next. So if you get a lightning lane once every two hours throughout the day, you may be able to experience up to eight lightning lane attractions in a day. So keep that in mind, it is just a great way to help you get more attractions into your day by purchasing Disney Genie Plus service to bypass a few standby queues and as well to use your augmented reality lenses and learn more about the theme parks through audio tales. Disney Genie Plus service is available for purchase pre-arrival and your travel professional can add that on to any Walt Disney Travel Company vacation package for you. Now, last up, we do have select attractions throughout the Walt Disney World Resort that are individual attraction selections. You may remember I referred to this with Remy's Ratatouille Adventure at Epcot. This is where select attractions are not included in Disney Genie Plus, like Star Wars Rise of the Resistance, Remy's Ratatouille Adventure, Seven Dwarfs Mine Train, and Pandora Flight of Passage. For these attractions, if you would like to utilize the Lightning Lane and make a reservation that day, 
starting at 7 a.m. each morning for that day, you can go in and purchase a Lightning Lane experience for that attraction to come back at a designated line and bypass the standby. Individual attraction selection does not have to be coincide with Disney Genie Plus. They are two separate items. You can choose to purchase Disney Genie Plus and not purchase individual attraction selection or choose to purchase an individual attraction selection for an attraction and not purchase Disney Genie Plus or not purchase any of them and just enjoy all the attractions by utilizing the standby queue. Whichever way you choose to go, Disney Genie, Disney Genie Plus, and individual attraction selections are a day of service to help you navigate and make the most of your Walt Disney World vacation. With that, I know I've covered a lot on this really high level overview of the Walt Disney World Resort. For more details on pricing incredible vacation packages, what current promotions are available, please reach out to your trusted travel professional today to help plan your magical Walt Disney World vacation. Thank you so much for tuning in with me today. I appreciate it and I look forward to seeing you at the Walt Disney World Resort soon. Have a magical day. Thank you. Thank you very much, Frank. Great presentation. If anybody has any questions, feel free to put them in the chat.